What's up, Teddy Betty Game Squad? This is your girl, Chat with K, and I'm back with another Smack Bang video. But if this is your first time tuning into my channel, just do me a favor, click like, click share, and click subscribe. And then, talk to me in the comment section. I promise I'll talk back to you. Guys, look what I'm gonna do today before I tell you to have a good weekend. We are going to try the McDonald's chicken sandwich. Let's, well, they new and improved because they always already had a chicken sandwich. So this is going to be a new and improved chicken sandwich. So they say. All right, so I'm going to try this chicken sandwich with you guys today while I tell you to have a blessed weekend, have some fun, do some things, get some rest, do whatever it's going to do to make you happy, okay? All right. All right, guys, so I'm going to pray over this really, really quick before it get cold, and we're gonna get right in to see what this chicken sandwich is about. All right, and I wanna take the time to dedicate this video to two of my chatty baddies. One will be Bliss143. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, sis, for rocking with me all this time. And also, the other one will be right there, Tanisha Armstrong. Shout out, sis, this video is for you. I love how you support me so much on your channel. So it's only be fitting if I do the same thing for you. All right. So let's me pray over this and we're going to get to tasting this sandwich. All right. Father God, thank you yet again for another day of life. Thank you for this food I'm about to receive for nourishing my, my body. In Jesus name I pray. Amen. All right. Short and sweet. Okay. Now I've already, I know y'all see my little frost is sitting over there. And I kind of started on it before I got on this camera because I wanted to melt, but because it, it's not about the frosty. And this video is not sponsored by McDonald's, by the way. It's sponsored by my coins. Well, Mr. Man's coins. But it's not sponsored by McDonald's, all right? But they can sponsor me if they want to. They truly can because I love their nuggets. So McDonald's, you hear this? Yeah, girl, I am in love with your chicken nugget, and so is my dog. We will not have him intervening in this video today because he is downstairs with Mr. Man. Yes, he is. Because I was like, uh, bro, I hear him puffing and puffing in my videos. I'm like, uh, dude, you got you to gotta stay gone. You got to stay gone. I should have got me a little knife. But you guys know your girl loves chicken. So what does it come? What's on it? Um, It's just... One pickle, looks like. And I got the spicy one. I should have got one of each and tried both of them, but you guys know I have to do them on separate videos because your girl can't eat like that. She truly cannot. So that's probably small enough for me. I'm going to have to try to finish that because it's spicy and I want to give it to my dog. So, how was you guys week thus far? <laughs> Hello. Mm -hmm. One moment. Mmm. Anybody know McDonald's fries are very good when they're fresh to cook. <clears throat> I'm getting into the sandwich because I got something to tell y'all. I got another kiki moment for y'all. Another kiki moment. Mm. And I know my last Smack Bay Friday, I was telling y'all about this comment I got, but I want to make sure you guys understand. <laughs> I was not upset. I truly wasn't. It was just a kiki moment. You got another kiki moment coming. All right. So stay. Put, oh, wait a minute, is that cheese? Oh, no, that's just a spicy sauce, I guess. Let's just try this sandwich, shall we? Mm -mm. It definitely have a little kick to it. It kind of tastes like the same spice that uh, Popeyes use. So it's just to me, it's maybe a version of the Popeyes chicken sandwich because it feels like it's, I mean, it feels like it tastes like it still got that same kick to it because I like spicy. That settles my stomach. I know that's weird, but it does. Okay. But. I don't hear no crunch. Where the crunch at, McDonald's? 
No hand up front. But it just tastes like a chicken sandwich, um, the Popeye's chicken sandwich to me. I may be wrong, but for me it does. Let me know in the comment section, have you tried this spicy chicken sandwich from McDonald's? And let me know what you think. All right? Mm-hmm. Because. Mm -mm. <sighs> Today is actually Saturday that I'm filming this, but you won't see it till next Friday. Y'all right now I, I record my videos on the weekend. Mm-hmm. Thank you guys for continuing to rock with me. I greatly appreciate you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and oh, <laughs> by the time you see this video, you've also seen King's short video. Uh, I don't know how many views he have had by the time I filmed this because I just uploaded it today on Saturday. But he was pulling a mattress. <laughs> I'm like, this dog. Luana and I had went out and got another mattress for our bed. As you can see, that one was way past two. Okay. And so, you know, men, they procrastinate a lot. At least mine does. <laughs> but until you put your foot down. You get stuff moving. As the old saying go, happy wife, happy life. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. But, <laughs> there was this older couple that Lawana and I met. Mm, no, it wasn't Lawana and I take that back. Mm. My mom, man. It was a, they did this type of communication retreat thing for Jansen at the Department of Corrections. So <laughs> he had asked the question for husbands when it's coming to communicating with your, with your spouse. So they asked, do you want to be happy or do you want to be right? Okay. Meaning... That nine times out of ten, <laughs> you just agree with your husband. I mean, agree with, agree with your spouse, and let her be right, so you can be happy. <laughs> All right. Mm hmm. I agree wholeheartedly. Mm -mm. So when it's the man, I can say we need a mattress. We need it on the mattress. He's like, I'm going to take care of it. I'm going to take care of it. I'm going to take care of it. The clock's ticking at this point. Tick, tick, tock, tock, tick, tock, tick, tock. I said, like, okay. So they're going to take care of it. Excuse me, getting a little cold. The clock is ticking. Tick, tock, tick, tock. Like, okay. So, on, what was that, Friday? Yeah, they had to go to the doctor. So, Friday when I left the doctor, I'm like, mm -mm. do you want to be happy and let me be right? Because we about to have a discussion. And the safe word ain't going to save you <laughs> if I don't give me a mattress. He's like, oh, gosh. <laughs> so, we went after I left the doctor's office. To go get me a mattress for my bed, a new mattress for my bed. So when we was pulling it down, the stirs, by the way, the king was like, Is this for me? <laughs> and he started messing with it, playing with it. And so I just started recording him. I was like, mm, Okay. I was like, Bad dog moment. So that was, that was the little short story behind that short that I put up there of King pulling that thing down the stairs, which was hilarious, by the way. Tummy. Mm-hmm. Anywho, 
I'm not gonna keep y'all. I really truly am not. I just wanna chase this sandwich. Mm hmm. Really did. And like I say, it's like a, it tastes like a, well, at least with the sauce for me, it's a downgrade of the Popeye's chicken sandwich because I think they use a piece of the breast in there and it definitely does not have the crunch. So, mm -mm. but I'm going to say it's not a bad sandwich. It's not. All right, to my little kiki moment. All right. Y'all gonna start hearing these kiki moments on my videos, right? So bear with me. But this is not YouTube related. It's really not. So I went out. The one I was busy, like I said, Friday, because we got the mattress, had to get it set up. Had to take things off the wall to get the new one put in. All this kind of stuff. So it was a hectic day. And on top of that was treatment day, right? So he says, uh, let's go and just get, you know, something fast food real quick so we could. Because both of us was tired at this point. Both of us. So I was like, right. I had to shower and all that. He told me, come on. I'm like, um, you go. I was like, no, come on. So I was like, okay, come on. Got up. And went out with Mr. Man. Now the kicky moment is, we went through a fast food restaurant drive through. Not gonna name names. Don't want to put them on blast, but I will. All right, so we get our food. He got a, I got a chicken sandwich from them. You know your girl chicken. Mm -hmm. I got a chicken sandwich from them. So Lawan got whatever he got and fries, whatever, whatever, and the drinks, whatever. And, I, and as soon as we, you know, like paid, they putting the food out the window. And I, and I said, um, that's kind of fast. And so let me, t let me taste it. So I put the bag open, take out my little tater, french fries. And you can tell that food that's been sitting on that heat light that is not fresh. So I was like, mm-mm. So the one rolled down the window, he's like, um, this food is not fresh. And she said, well, did you ask for it fresh? At first, I was like, is there any books in here um do we need a stupology book yeah i said it stupology because that was a stupid thing to ask us did we ask for it fresh i'm like i'm sorry i did not know that i had to always say fresh when you come to the drive through for 22 dollars, i shouldn't have to ask for the food to be fresh let me mind let me say that again 22 dollars, but i gotta ask for it fresh uh what a handbook for stupid stupidology because I need the handbook because I, I wasn't aware. So I'm like, mm mm. She said, well, well, you just pull up so we can make you some more fries. So when we pulls up, I'm still sitting in the car. And like right now, I'm already irritated. It was, it was, uh, it was a treatment day. Well, first of all, a doctor, treatment. Mattress store, med delivery. We need somebody to help bring the mattress in. They don't really come in your house anymore because of the whole ugly bug. So I'm trying to help Juan get this mattress upstairs. I'm like, um, bro, I don't care who you, you got to go outside. You got to flag down the first land you see. I said, I don't care what he say he want for his re re reward for helping you get this mattress up here. I don't care what it is. We gonna have to pay somebody because your girl don't have it in her. I was already starting to feel yucky from my treatment. So I'm like, uh, bro, you better go find somebody. I don't care what they want. I don't care if it's a beer. I don't care what they want. Go find somebody. So he went outside, Lord and behold, my friend down the street, well, my neighbor down the way, 
her husband was just getting in his car and the woman's like, hey, can you help me? And he's just like, yeah. So he came in the house and I stepped back, you know, and step back because, you know, I don't had to the ugly bug before. So I kind of stepped back and I was like, I'm sorry, but your girl didn't have anything left in the tank to help him. I tried to get this, help him get this mattress up here, these stairs, but it wasn't, it wasn't working. I'm not two men in a truck. Sorry. I can't get this mattress up here for him. So he had to help. And he's just like, oh, no problem. Come here. Two men got the mattress in, plopped it up on the bed. And I'm like, uh, LeBoy, you want to come in here and look at this bed? So he came and looked at the bed. I said, you see how hot this is? This, this mattress put me so hot up. And it's a king size bed. So now I'm sitting on it and my feet is dangling. Because I'm like, okay, now I need a, st a step stool. Literally do, because I have to hop up there. I said, I literally need a step stool. This mattress got this bed sitting up so high. I said, but it's okay. So when King comes up, he's just like, mama. <laughs> so he usually be like right here. Now he's like, um, what is this? So he started looking down, looking up, looking down. Then he goes all around the bed, sniffing. And he's like, uh, this ain't this ain't my, this ain't your bed. He said, mom, why are you up so high? I was like, baby, can't tell you. But that was my little kiki moment. And like I say, guys, I'm not really hungry all that much because I had this ice cream. So I just wanted to taste the sandwich with you. I'm not really, it's, it's okay. It's not bad. It's really not because it's kind of, it's still good because it has the spice on it from McDonald's and then it, and it's minus the, cr the, the crunch. So other than that, it's okay. All right. It is OK. I hope you guys have a blessed weekend. I really, truly do. I hope you guys have a safe weekend. I do. All right. And I speak nothing but peace and happiness over your life. And whatever it is that you want to do, I hope you are successful at it, whether it's YouTube or any of your other businesses or whatever it is that you do that brings you joy. I hope you pass. I hope you find peace within your life. And this is Chadwick K. You already know what I'm going to say. Love God. Love yourself. Love others. Stay with Get ready, Chadwick K. I am out with this week, Smack Bang Friday. And I'll see you guys next week for another one. Bye-bye.